all animal industries. Um, and we, we travel around actually doing demonstrations and spreading the truth about what goes on in these industries. PETA doesn't take a stance on any um, politicians or political issues. And why did you choose the snake thing? Well, today we're, our activist is burying her skin to draw attention to what happens to animals who are killed for their skin. I mean, animals like alligators, lizards, crocodiles, and snakes, they may not seem cute or cuddly to some people, but they do feel pain and fear, just like all animals do, and we want people to extend their compassion to these animals as well. You know, animals who, like alligators, who are raised on farms for their skin, spend their entire lives crammed on these tiny concrete slabs, sometimes hundreds of young alligators to one building, forced to live in their own waste before being killed by having a steel chisel driven through the back of their necks. And crocodiles, on the other hand, are hunted in the wild, where they're shot, stabbed, or have, you know, they're caught with hooks and chains before being skinned alive. And that's just hideous. I think anybody who has a dog or a cat can understand that these animals are feeling as well and that there's no excuse in the 21st century when there's so many wonderful alternatives available to be wearing any animal skins. Marketing is um, a fun way of getting out a serious message. Um, we have a lovely lady out here that people can stop and look at our beautiful artwork and talk to, take pictures with. And while they're here talking with her, looking at her, we also hand out flyers or literature with the more important series. Over here. If you see that website, PETA.org, if you go on there, um, there will be a little link that you can even in places where we've been warned they're conservative or that people won't be interested in the message. It seems like we just get so much positive reaction. People are shocked. Doing so, we welcome anyone who we can spread the message. It's all right. It's no problem. We're having a great time. Well, we're not within the organization. Um, we just stand against PETA. Um, we think they're... Uh, go away with some information that they didn't have before and you know kind of understanding where we're coming from and they're shocked when they see the, the way that animals are treated. Well, we're just local here. I mean every time we go shopping we can choose to be compassionate and it's so easy you know instead of getting that pricey python bag go for the, the lesser priced imitation bag or, and never go for fur.